Welcome to the channel. Today we're doing a trip to Bono Hills. Bono Hills Resort is a spectacular theme park perched on the high mountains of central Vietnam. Join us for the sights around the theme park, three floors of arcades and games, the Alpine Coaster and best of all, the Golden Bridge. It's about a two hour scenic drive from either Hoi An or Da Nang. It's a massive amusement park serviced by a huge cable car system, one of the biggest in the world. Bono Hills receives about one and a half million visitors every year, and you can see why. It's just entertaining for every member of the family, from the smallest to the oldest. The park sites start from the entrance already. Before you even get onto one of the cable cars, you'll see some beautiful sites, some places to stop in, and some snacks to enjoy. The park's flowers, plants and shrubbery is just amazing. As you travel through the park, you just see it become even more beautiful. Throughout the park there are beautiful ponds, water features and canals filled with beautiful koi fish. To get to the main part of the resort, you use the cable car system. This system takes you over the most magical scenery, almost a Jurassic Park-like uh, view. You'll see beautiful waterfalls, lush greenery, and just beautiful sights overall. As you can see, it was a bit of a cloudy day, but to our surprise, because Bono Hills is almost at 1,500 meters above uh, sea level, we actually poked right through the clouds and emerged on a really sunny day on, at the resort. From the top, you can see the other branches of the cable car, taking you to different parts of the park You'll see that later in the video too. We start off at the French Village, a really exciting part of the park. It reminds me a little bit of Disney Paris. just an amazing place to take a stroll, take in the scenery, check out all of the new characters that are slightly different to your Disney characters and take a snack to get us started for the day. The park also has some parades which are great fun for young and old. The characters are especially good for the small kids in the crowd, really taking some time to spend with them.
from there we visited the Le Jardin Gardens. There are actually nine separate gardens so you can take as much time as you want strolling through them. We took the cable car to the next stop and on the way you can actually see the Alpine coaster that we will ride later on in the video. This stop that had the attraction that I really wanted to see the most, the Golden Bridge. It was an absolute spectacular view. The bridge actually is 150 meters long, so much bigger than I thought originally. In my opinion, this is a must-see attraction when you're visiting Vietnam. Not only is the bridge amazing to be on, it also affords you some beautiful views over the valley, over the mountains and the cable cars that run beneath it. In the distance you can see the Buddha, that you take another cable car to. We just ran out of time in the day and didn't really get around to it. It's a good excuse to go back for a second trip. If we go back to the Alpine coaster, it was time for a bit of an adrenaline rush. Unfortunately, there's a bit of a wait for the coaster. We stood for about a half an hour, but considering there were no other queues, we were happy to wait a while. From there, we went to the Fantasy Park. This amusement center has got three stories and is based on the tale, Journey to the Center of the Earth. Here yeah, kids are entertained with over 90 different arcade games, all obviously included in the price. The center of the park is this adrenaline rush ride, good fun for everybody. Also a number of 3D, 4D and even 5D theatres that will keep everybody entertained. After a long day at the park, this seemed to be the right place to spend some time. It was starting to get a bit late and we just thought we'd get something to eat and then stroll around the rest of the town before heading back. We spent about five hours in the park and I must say in retrospect it was definitely not enough. The park has definitely got enough entertainment that will keep you busy for a full day. Thank you for joining us on our trip to Barnai Hills. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like and subscribe and we'll bring you some more videos just like it. Thanks so much. Cheers.